guarantee you, you will get a charge out of our next performer. He is unstoppable, Chipper Lowe. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. I asked the studio audience what unusual items they might have in the trunks of their car. Really unusual items they came up with. And I made a list right here of some of the top most unusual ones. Let's take a look. Number one, waffle iron. Number two, you have stuffed moose head. Uh, three, petrified french fries. Number four, clown wig, uh, scorpion, tap shoes, moldy watermelon, I don't want to ask. Garden gnome, probably someone else's and you took off. Uh, <laughs> you have holy bowling ball. Now they told me that was not like a bowling ball owned by the Pope. That was actually a bowling ball that they cut so many holes in it to get the right finger measurements that it was became unusable. So they threw it in the back of their trunk. Uh, we have shark fin, bagpipes, which really the back of a trunk is the best place for bagpipes, yes. Hotel bathroom, stolen. Gorilla suit, maybe not. Parachute, flattened squirrel, melted bag of ice, empty ant farm, set of dentures. With those in mind, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time to play the Junk in the Trunk game. Are you ready? I said, are you ready? All right, follow along. Here we go. I'd like everyone to choose a number from one to nine. Choose a number from one to nine. Please keep that number to yourself. Got it? All right. Now, multiply that by three. Got it? All right. Then, I'd like you to add three to it. Got it? Ba -ba -ba. And now, multiply by three again. And we just lost half the audience. <laughs> All right, now, at this point, some of you may have a two-digit number. If you do, I'd like you to make this even more random. Take the first digit and add it to the second digit to come up with a completely new number. Got it? All right, take a look at the board, find your number and the corresponding item. And now, this box. I've been on stage the entire time. Inside there is something from my trunk that I think you're gonna find sort of interesting. As a matter of fact, I think it may match what at least one of you is thinking. If it does match, I want you to do me a favor. Whoever that person is, if it matches, you jump up out of your seat. You go nuts, you applaud, you just go crazy. Promise? Not good enough. Promise? Moment of truth. Let's take a look. <laughs> Mighty tasty. <laughs> okay, this is embarrassing because there was supposed to be more of you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Live audience. <laughs> I, uh, oh, I forgot to tell you. I always use a watermelon to protect my bowling ball. Is it a man? 